to filming the final season at the moment and so aren't able to be here in person. So to collect the award on behalf of the programme, please welcome John Bradley, who plays Samuel Tarley, and Hannah Murray, his fictional other half, Gilly, mother of baby Sam. Good evening. It feels quite, it actually feels quite strange just for two, any two people to be up here trying to collect this award on behalf of such a vast team, but we're very, very proud to be here. When I did my first day's work on Game of Thrones nearly eight years ago, I knew nothing of how TV production worked. I remember getting my first call sheet the day before I shot my very first scene and not really knowing what I was looking at, and I read that the scene was two pages long, and I thought, well, how long can that possibly take? <laughs> I was always under the impression that they just had the set and they set 20, 30 cameras up, hidden cameras in little nooks and crannies around the set. They kicked the actors into the set. We did it a couple of times and then we went home. In fact, what I thought when I first saw that it was going to be two pages long was, what on earth am I going to do with my afternoon? <laughs> And now, the, the point is, after all these years, I look back on that first day and I'm struck by how lucky I am. I was given such an incredible learning experience, the best learning experience in the world, working alongside some of the very best craftspeople at work anywhere. Uh, we as actors will forever owe a huge debt of gratitude for them, for inspiring us every single time we walk onto the set and every single time we see the finished product on the screen, every day learning something new from them and every day finding new things to admire them for. When you see so many phenomenally talented people in so many departments working at the very top of their game and getting breathtaking results time after time, it really forces you to bring your very best efforts to the table, if only to make sure that you don't look inadequate by comparison. Every year they're given scripts that on paper seem totally unfilmable and every time they put it on the screen to mind-blowing effect. We as actors are so lucky to get to step into the world they create and we are as in awe of their work as the fans of the show all over the world. The show is a global phenomenon, and what makes us proudest is that the work of so many British and Irish talents are being recognised on such a grand scale. We know that our showrunners, David and Dan, are as grateful to be working with this incredible team of people. Sadly, they couldn't be here tonight as they're busy shooting our final season, but they've sent this special message. Hi, I'm David Benioff. And I'm D.B. Weiss. We are the writers, co-creators, and, and producers of Game of Thrones, and we want to thank you all at BAFTA for uh, honoring us with this award, and we're very sorry that we couldn't be there tonight. Um, we all know that it, uh, one person doesn't make a film or a TV show, and two people don't make a film or a TV show, but dozens and hundreds of people make a film or a TV show. Uh, it's uh, fitting to honor the craftspeople who uh, work on this show and who make this show, because every single thing that you see that we get to put in every single frame of Game of Thrones is something that is lovingly crafted and designed and built by these people. Every day we are in awe of what we see them turn out and we are very, very fortunate to be working with uh, craftsmen, craftswomen of their caliber. So on their behalf, thank you very much. We're very sorry we couldn't be there with you, but uh, we hope you all have a great night. Thank you so much. Turns, turns out that's how tired you look after being in charge of Game of Thrones for 10 years. Um, thank you, um, thank you um, so much for this, BAFTA. And uh, I believe that, that um, we're going to invite some people to the stage now, H. Yeah. You can do it. Um, yeah, as you know, we have some of the very talented craftspeople here tonight, and we would love to welcome them to the stage.